Now see the ad I set up before, it is approved now. So what I want to do now is I want to copy the post ID now and use it for my, my brand awareness now. So what I want to do now is I want to copy the post ID and use it for brand awareness so that it will cost me less and it will reach more people, right? So I will go to this hamburger icon. I click on page post. The verification code should be sent to me. The verification code has been sent to me already to my phone number registered on this account. So I'm going to enter the code now. 188871. I'll click confirm. I'm going to click on this drop down and select my. I will click on add post. I'll click on this drop down to select my page. This is the post. These are the posts here. I wonder why there are many. So, but let me look at the time. You can see this is. 413, 413, 408, 408, 408, 408. Okay, we don't know which one is which now. I think this 413 is the original one. Let's copy this 413 because that is the last one that I did. Let's highlight it and copy. Then we go to notepad paste it and this is our post id copy it okay now you are going to go to your ad manager now select that particular ad account okay ensure you are using that same ad account now i want to use brand awareness now so it's a question of getting one of the brand awareness I have earlier. Okay, this is one of my brand awareness. So I can simply select this one. Edit. And I'm going to, let me put it on. Then click edit. So I can duplicate one of these. Let me duplicate this one as video. So I will duplicate it. Yeah, I'm going to rename it as how to load. Okay, it's even here. I think I can select this video. And we are going to use existing post. Here we are going to enter our post ID and check this. The preview will show very soon and this is it this is a preview here so i can publish it now no long story now because i copied the post id from an existing ad so I'm, i'll publish it now it is already published let's view details Click down. So I'm going to go back. I want to turn off all these ones because I want to measure those that interacted with that particular ad. So let me turn all this one off so that I can know who 
actually interacted with that post I want to be able to measure it. Let's turn all this one off. Okay. It's been turned off now. Yeah. It will soon be approved. It's in review now, so it will soon be approved. What I will do now is I want to go and create a custom audience. I will create a custom audience. The other one that I set before, I need to turn it off. Let me turn this one off. Let me go to the add set level and turn it off. Okay, that one has been turned off. That traffic objective has been turned off. So the only one we have now is the brand awareness, which is in review now. All right, so I want to go and create the audience now because I will be using the audience when I will create conversion objective. So all I need to do is to go to audience, then I will click on create custom video. Yes, select video. Then click next. Then engagement. People who watched my video to 50%. Let's say 50%. Okay, then I will select that particular video. I will select the Facebook page. This is the, the video. You can see the date is posted. Click confirm. Then I'm going to name it. Those who watched load Revit family to 50% for anyone that wants it to 50% at least somehow is interested so I'm going to create that audience now I'm done let me see if I can create another one Custom video nest select engagement. Let me select seventy five per cent. Then select the video. Let's select Instagram. Okay, this one have a campaign. Select campaign. Okay, this is the campaign. And this is the video. Select this video. Then click confirm. Those who was load family to. 75% campaign ok 
pin then click create done now what if we are not able to get a lot of audience to watch it to 75 percent let me step it let me step it lower video next engagement type let's select 50 percent let's select video and let's select campaign let's select the campaign this is the campaign select the video confirm leave this one at 365 days give it a name those who watched load um load revit family to 50% campaign then click creates audience so in the next video the campaign i will create i will use this particular audience i'm sure you benefit something from this video see you in the next video bye